right, so this is uh, old school wrestling stuff with Ginyu. All right, so here's the magazine and whatnot. Got some autographs here, I think. Let's see. It's been ages since I've skimmed through this. Back when uh, Big Daddy Cool was champ and William Shatner was hanging out with Brett the Hitman Hart. Oh, here we go. Man Mountain Rock. Whatever happened to him, I don't know. But there's his autograph. Oh, what's that? The then new tag team champs? <laughs> well, if it isn't Shawn Michaels and Medusa. Alright. Oh, yeah. Jeff Jarrett. <laughs> Dallas Hart. Oh, so this was uh, Next Generation. Yeah, you look at him now, he's all old. He's got the white hair. He talks about he wants to be Cable in the new Deadpool movie. I'm just going to skim through this. This is the April of 95 issue. Oh, well, there's a nice, uh, nice poster right there. You got Miss Baywatch Beauty, along with Shawn Michaels. What did they say back then? Good friends, better enemies? What happened here? Oh, looks like I taped it. Oh, that makes sense. That there was some damage there. The Royal Rumble. Oh, Pamela Anderson. Diesel versus Brett the Hitman Hart. The sharpshooter. Oh yeah, so many classic moments. Double J takes on Razor Ramon. There's Bam Bam Bigelow. Making his presence known back then. May he rest in peace. Oh man. Who's that? I remember this guy. They always joked about him about having a jock strap on his face. Mabel and King Kong Bundy. Main event. Shawn Michaels. Versus Big Daddy Cool. Yep. Oh, here we go. Owen Hart and Mystery Partner versus the Smoking Guns. Yeah. This is old school right here. Oh, yeah. I remember this guy. The guy with all the uh, symbols on his face. He was cool. Yeah. Oh, here's some artwork from the hitman himself. Yep. We got Spock over here. Manitar. I wonder what ever happened to him. Oh, there's Lex Luger. The King. Yeah, he was he had the King's Court at the Hartford Civic Center. Ah, oh, here we go. Uh Bart got his autograph on that card. So is that it? Let's see here. I got the newspaper. Haven't looked through this in a while. The Harper Current, March 30, 1995. Still have that. Oh, yeah. And I got this big one. Brit Hitman Heart. Yep. Let's move that over there. Uh, this 
this Hartford Current could be worth something, I guess. I don't know. I, if I remember correctly, I gave the poster that was in here to uh, one of my friends at the uh, GMC. Oh, and here's the official souvenir book. Okay, let's open this up. Yeah, salt and pepper. Damn, that's how they looked back then. Not that bad at all. Alright. Oh, Sid. Psycho Sid, that's what they called him back then. <laughs> and here we go. Mike Rotunda, a.k.a. IRS's autograph right here. Special challenge. All the footballers. One, two, three kids. Autograph right there. Owen Hart, his autograph right there. You know, it turns out he was my height, which was awesome. Like, dude, man, that's awesome that you're a wrestler and you're as short as I am. That ass. And of course, once again, Brett the Hitman's heart autograph right there. Undertaker's autograph right here. Oh, remember these guys? Because I sure as hell don't. Whatever happened to these guys? They had cool hair, though. I even saw a bulldog walking around. Never got a chance to have his autograph, but uh, he was walking around the Civic Center. Alright, so Diesel versus Shawn Michaels. Yep, 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 yep. This was the setup. Bob Backlund. Undertaker versus Bundy. Yeah, Smoking Guns. Luger and the British Bulldog. Yeah. This is my wrestling paraphernalia. It's not much, but it's probably worth something. And the poster I gave uh, to my friend at the local GMC was signed by Paul Bearer and The Undertaker. May Paul Bearer rest in peace. So I thought I would share this with my peeps. Maybe they can, uh, I don't know, eBay it. But these guys sign autographs all the time, so it's probably not worth that much. And I'm not really that strapped for money to sell it anyway. So, uh, yeah. Later, peeps. Take care.